every now and then you get on a bike where it feels right as rain, where everything's tight as a tiger and it's mechanical perfection personified. This is this is that bike. There's a little bit of manufacturing tolerances, tolerances in all production vehicles, and sometimes some come out just right. The cranks balance perfectly, everything's tight. This is a one owner, 11,614 mile, like brand new 93 FLHS electric glide. This is a uh, uh, local collector. Massachusetts just passed away, unfortunately. Uh, Kenny knows more about the situation because he was more of a friend of Kenny's. Kenny sold him a couple of bikes. And his brother called Junior and said, hey, uh, we, we want, want you to sell his bikes. Um, this isn't being sold because someone was upgrading. This was a forever bike for Mr. Perone, one of Junior's friends. And this thing is absolutely perfect. Uh, it has some tasty upgrades on it, but it's everything that you would want to be stock on a classic motorcycle, like the paint job, the running gear, the tires, the wheels, uh, everything is original OEM, Harley or replacement. The tires are actually uh, been replaced, but uh, just 11,614 miles, original stock bars, mirrors, highway pegs, um, and it has uh, some tasty upgrades. It has a stage one kit on it, which opens up the stock restrictive air box and EPA mandated mufflers with a nice set of dual turnout, dual exhaust, and the Harley Davidson original 80 cubic inch electric glide cover, which is super nice, and those are getting hard to come by. This bike's 27 years old, folks, and it looks, feels, sounds like a brand new motorcycle. My dad used to say, if it looks like a duck and it quacks like a duck, it must be a duck. And this thing is, uh, you know, uh, I've said, you heard me say before, you know, a cucumber turned into a pickle. It's hard to get them back to the This is an original cucumber right here. I can think of more acronyms. Everyone I've, I've ever, I guess I could just say it's Kaplan America approved, which is I'm putting my name on it. And uh, this is a bike I would I would enjoy keeping and riding. 80 cubic inch, 1340 cc, five, five speed transmission, belt drive, um, triple disc brakes, uh, the paint on the frame, the paint on the bike, the original factory, 27 year old leather saddle is in mint condition, like 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 new condition, um, has the FLHS electric guide rack. It's got the backrest, the, the handlebar grips. It's got, I mean, the hand grips. It has the uh, luggage rack on the factory saddlebags, hard bags, and it has the factory OEM uh, Screaming Eagle Harley Davidson catalog saddlebag protectors, which give it a nice look, a little bit of extra chrome, which works well with the black paint job with the orange and red pinstripe. The tires have 90% tread. They probably have less than 1,000 miles on them. It's it's stunning, a beautiful piece. Junior, is there anything you'd like to add about this bike? That that um, I mean, it kind of speaks for itself. The pictures, the way it rides, it does have a smoked Harley Davidson windshield. The stock one's clear and a little bit taller. I like the little bit lower windshield. Uh, has the chrome nacelle and triple chrome running lights. Big black balanced Harley Davidson front fender with the original reflectors, light on the top, and of course the chrome Harley Davidson fender skirt on the bottom. Uh, you'd be hard pressed to find her nicer or cleaner 93, it went through the full rotisserie detail. What is that? Well, basically we start out with a nice steam cleaning with our $8,000 steam cleaner. The Harley Davidson uh, finishes are beautiful and they, they polish up nice, but we steam cleaned it, then hand washed it. The engine was was uh, steam cleaned and hand washed. The, the tins were buffed, professionally buffed and hand polished with, I think we put three coats of Carnuba paste wax on this. I know, I know at least two coats of the Car Mother's California Gold Carnival Pace Wax. The, the original fork lowers uh, have been polished. That's not chrome. Those are polished and they're in beautiful condition. It has the chrome axle covers on it. Um, highway pegs are nice. It's got the, of course, the crash bars. Uh, the only reason I'd want crash bars on my bike is to put the highway, highway pegs on. And when you're over six foot, it sure is nice to have another spot to rest your feet. Um, just a beautiful piece. Even has the uh, triple uh, uh, chrome protector here for the side covers. The um, turnout exhaust gives it a nice little rumble, not too much. Just enough. Opens it up so it's a little bit better free breathing. It also have a, has a nice high quality Marlins clock mounted on the handlebar. The original tachometer, speedometer, looked like it just came out of the box. Looks brand new. There's no dead bugs in there or, or scratches or damage. It's, it's pristine. The fuel gauge works. The oil gauge works. The neutral light, the high beam, the uh, turn signal indicator. Um, Everything's there, folks. So, yeah, if you have any questions, give us a call, 860-454-7024. We'll be happy to ship this bike anywhere in the country for you. Um, it does have the air-adjustable front suspension, which is nice. 
right here. Um, you can add, add more air in for more spirited riding or two-up riding. The um, rear suspension is the original factory Harley Davidson air shocks, which are like brand new. It rides like a it rides like a dream, it really does. Thanks for watching and God bless America.